Aside, kids, I'll do it. Is he strong? When you want it, kids. We're trying to get it down to the pond. Even the best laid plans often go astray. Let's do it. That'd be great, Ollie. Thanks a lot. Curses foiled again. Careful not to touch those sticks. They may look innocent enough, but they're actually a trap set by the wicked old fox to capture us. <laughs> All you have to do is spring it like this. Won't bother anyone now. I'm too smart and strong to be taken in by foolish things like that. That fox is no lame brain either. True, but he doesn't stand a chance of catching someone like me. You're really not afraid of him at all? <laughs> Neither would you be if you were as strong as I am, Big. If he tries anything, you'll be sorry. <laughs> Let's go. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> he won't trouble us any longer. It's all right. You can come out. I'm taking care of the fox. <laughs> Did you do it, Ollie? Well, I just used my wits. I ducked him in the pool for good. Come take a look. Huh? He's not there. I don't get it. But if you drowned him, he couldn't have run away. He was probably just playing possum. He's crafty. No way. I found him hiding in one of those big old jar things, so I just threw it in the pond. Uh-oh. There was air in here, so he could breathe. He didn't drown. He must have. I sat on top of the thing and the fox was in it underwater. Sure, but right in an air bubble. Huh? I still can't figure out how in tarnation I'm still alive. Uh, maybe I've got it. I'll have to try an experiment. <laughs> Now to try it on a living creature. Gotcha! In you go. Let's see if it comes out of this alive. I think it's gonna work. All right. <laughs> uh, you're free, pal. I'm after ducks, not bugs. <laughs> oh, it's great to be a genius. <laughs> Why don't we see if the fish are biting? Let's go! There's nothing like a tasty duckling to whet the appetite. Look, there's a jar in the water. We can use it for playing, come on. Wee! 
We killed Fox! <laughs> <laughs> you killed the fox? That's hard to believe. How did you do it? Let's hear it. He was hiding in the jar so we sank it and he drowned. Oh, if you say so, but that's still hard to believe. Come on, look for yourself. <sighs> so you did do it, but how? We made sure he was stuck under there and couldn't get out at all. Well, I still don't get it. How did you do that? We jumped on top of the jar, rocked it back and forth, Dolly. That's exactly what I did, pals, but somehow he managed to escape. <laughs> That's because there was still a big bubble of air for him to breathe. But we took a nail and made a hole on the top. That way, as the air ran out, the water ran in and he drowned. Gotta admit, that was a great idea you had. Give credit where credit is due, that's what I always say, and you guys outsmarted the smart old fox. <laughs> 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 <laughs>